Hi, my name is Marlon Smith. I grew up in Silver Spring, Maryland. I'm the oldest of four boys. My brothers are Sean, Greg, and Lance. I went to the University of Virginia where I studied electrical engineering in school. And you know, in the back of my mind, when I went to college, I'm thinking my future wife is here on this campus. <laughs> you see, my parents met at Howard University. And so I just thought, okay, my wife is here. Well, needless to say, I dated some wonderful ladies, but none of them were my wife-to-be. And after graduating, I've dated more young ladies, and it was wonderful, but you know how it is. You meet somebody, at first it's exciting, and it's new, it's fresh, and then all of a sudden, as time goes on, something happens, and you end up going your own way. Well, that was my story. One day I was in church, and I'll never forget the pastor said, your life takes on new meaning when you turn your money and your honey over to God. And I tell you, it struck me. And I said, you know what? Maybe I need to do this because I had been meeting some wonderful ladies. And yet at the same time, it just never really turned into that lifelong relationship. And I said, you know, I'm going to get serious. And I made a commitment to tithe and to be celibate. And you know what? My life did take on new meaning. It was amazing. I later met my wife-to-be, Sarita. And I proposed at a family reunion and she accepted and Luckily, she accepted. <laughs> and we eventually got married, and, and we were blessed with a baby who we know was conceived during our honeymoon because, you see, up until that point of our courtship, we had been celibate. And so Jada Maya came into the world and, and has been trust a blessing for us. And the reason why I share this is because I want you to understand that life is interesting, and we all can relate to having wonderful relationships at the beginning and then something happens and then it dissipates. Well, we developed this online community because our purpose, our focus is to encourage, to educate, to empower newlywed couples, those engaged and those dating with sound godly principles and real life strategies from real life couples as to what it takes to experience healthy and positive relationships families, and marriages with a 0% divorce rate. <laughs> yes, you heard me, 0%. Now, I know right now some of you are thinking, Marlon, that could never happen. And you know and I know. We see the media reports, you know, the divorce rate is soaring and the problems in marriages and the husband's cheating and the wife's cheating. Well, let me say this. For those that trust God, all things are possible. And we're holding on to that that to those that trust God, all things are possible. And so I'm glad that you're here with us because we want to hear from you. Post your comments, share your ideas, share your insights, post your questions so we can do research and we can have a dialogue as to sharing ideas, sharing principles for what it takes to experience healthy and positive relationships. Each one teach one, each one reach one. Very glad you're here and remember this, your success is your choice. Stay blessed.